Bruce Miller, joined up here above all the action by my good friend Amanda Byram, welcoming you to Grand Slam tonight for the biggest game show champions ever will play their opening round matchups in the 16-player tournament, which will determine who will take home $100,000 and earn the right to be called the greatest contestant in all the land. First up, Nancy Christie, the only woman in the history of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire to win a million dollars. Meets up with Ogie Ogus, a $500,000 winner on Millionaire also, and a PhD candidate at Boston University. Let's meet these two millionaire winners. Nancy Christie, Tulsa, Oklahoma. I won a million dollars on Who Wants to Be a Millionaire. Just see, and that's my final answer. We have our first woman as a millionaire. It hasn't changed my life on a day-to-day -day basis. I am an eighth grade English teacher. I get questioned all the time, you know, are you still teaching? Well, yeah, but I don't have to. I do it because I love it. People ask me if I was nervous when I was on the show. I said, I stand in front of eighth graders every day. That's the toughest audience you'll ever have. I think she'll do great in Grand Slam. She's very smart, like they said, she's brilliant. Ken is going to be tough, Brad's going to be tough, Ed's going to be tough. Ogie, because he's just got this mind. Ogie Ogus, Boston, Massachusetts, by way of Annapolis, Maryland. I'm a graduate student at Boston University, where I study the brain. Ogie is ambitious and hyper-focused. I'm definitely not a trivia guy. I know very little trivia. I'm a brain guy. Specifically, I like to think about thinking. I spend a lot of effort thinking of cognitive techniques to use on Millionaire. My greatest regret is, on the million dollar question, I just absolutely did not prepare for the level of anxiety and stress and tension that I felt there, and so I just didn't have the guts to go through with it. It's too much at stake. I'm going to walk. Let's see the answer so you know. Oh, it was William. Oh, damn it. I don't think he's going to choke again on Grand Slam. Hopefully I'll have an advantage in the math round and in the verbal round and not let anybody run away on the trivia round on me. 